teacher magic unfreeze. Okay, so now my board is nice and clean and ready to move on. So a quick refresh, square numbers are the product of two identical factors. So we will start with the identical factor one. One times one equals one. Two times two equals four. Three times three equals nine. Four times four equals 16. What do you think would be next? We just went from one, two, three, four as factors. You would be correct. This would be if we had five rows and five columns, what would we need to skip count by? We would skip count by fives. Do that with me, okay? So, ready, go. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25. So, the squared number, which is the product of multiplying two factors of the same, five times five equals 25. This is a square number. It is the product of two identical factors. That means two factors that are the same. All right, so we are going to move on to if we were to look at our multiplication tables. Now, I do not know if you guys brought your multiplication tables home with you, but you can easily find multiplication tables either in your book or online. So here we have our square numbers going diagonal in blue. If we multiplied zero times zero, our square number would be zero. If we multiplied one times one, it would be one. Two times two is four and on and on. And here's what we just did. Five times five gives us 25 as our square number product. If we were to look at what six times six would be, well, you'd find the six on your multiplication table. You'd go all the way across and there you have it. There is our product. Six times six is 36.